Hi, and welcome to this episode of The Mitchell File. I'm your host, Roosevelt Mitchell III. A police union wants to turn random bystanders into basically vigilantes for hire by offering $500 to any civilian who helps cops wrestle down suspects who resist arrest. The cash proposal for the, from the Sergeant's Benevolent Association is aimed at getting those who would normally make videos of cops taking people into custody to put their phones down and actually get involved. State Senator Martin Golden, a retired cop, will introduce a new Good Samaritan law to shield civilians from the liability if they help cops because the current Good Samaritan law does not protect citizens who assist the first responders. Now, an existing law does cover those who give medical aid to an ailing person without the expectation of a reward. The union will pay for the rewards, but its officials hope pro-cop groups and private individuals will also pitch in. They did not give many details about what would constitute enough help to warrant a reward, although the union noted that grabbing and holding a suspect would qualify if the cops were in fact chasing that person. They said a panel of experts will rule on whether any assistance merited a payout. Now, I am sure that there was good intent behind this proposal, but let me get this right. Many states have implemented body cams for police officers based on history. There is an incident, the footage is slow to be released, if released at all, and the only way that the public has been able to view questionable police-involved shootings is from the cell phone footage of bystanders. But now they want to encourage bystanders to put those phones down, stop recording, and help them. Hmm, interesting, but I would love to hear what you think about this, so please leave a comment in the section below. And also, please remember to like and share this video. And until next time, my friends, be blessed and be encouraged.